the Samsung Galaxy S4 was about to revolutionize the handset market. A phone so highly specced that it would reinvent how we communicate. It was the next big thing in smartphone technology. The only problem was, coming from us, that kind of sounded like bullshit. We decided the best way to launch the Galaxy S4 was to get our fans to launch it for us. So we saved them from lining up outside a store and got them to line up online. Fans joined the smartphone line through Facebook and Twitter. Every day for the two weeks leading up to the launch, we gave them features of the S4 to promote through their social media network. The more their friends liked, reposted, retweeted, commented, and shared these features, the further up the line they moved. To get the first S4 in the country, all they had to do was get to the front of the line. The smartphone line was broadcast live to a massive electronic billboard, turning the virtual queue into a real-world line. The avatars moved and reacted like a normal line would. At night, they would go under blankets and into sleeping bags, and when it rained, they put up umbrellas. What happens is I tell my friends and family about how great the new Samsung phone is, and every time I do, a little speech bubble pops out, and people coming down here at ATS Square can actually see what I'm talking about. The more I share it, the closer I go up to the front of the line. As a result, 12,000 people queued for two weeks. They spread 85,000 stories to over 3 million people which had an organic reach of over 15 million people. Since the Galaxy S4 launched, market share of the premium smartphone market has grown by 12%. Instead of leaving our biggest fans waiting outside a store for days, we turned them into our media channel and proved that the Galaxy S4 really is the next big thing.